Technology seems to have failed the Road Transport and Safety Agency, RATSA. RATSA has procured a mechanized motor vehicle test machine to ease the process of examining the fitness of vehicles. Other than making the examination process easier, the machine has turned out to be a challenge as the process appears to be more slower than ever before. As a result, hundreds of vehicles are made to queue up at RATSA's Mimosa Examination Center. This is what has prompted Transport Works and Supply Minister Yang Kanga to suspend the use of the machine in question. We need to improve the general management of the facilities at Mimosa. As Rasta is executing the above, they will now resort to a manual of physical inspections as previously done in order to reduce the congestion. To this effect, Rasta has been directed to resort to manual of physical inspections as previously done in order to reduce on the congestion. Government discovered a few lapses because there was a lot of congestion and I think the pace at which the inspections were being conducted was so slow. And in order to prevent further congestions and improve the operations, RATSA has been instructed to, one, recheck the efficiency and effectiveness of the machinery operations, to improve the machine availability of the fixed test lanes. Three, start constant sensitization of machinery operations to the general public. In order to cover up for the inconvenience caused to motorists, government has decided to extend the period of renewals of road traffic licenses to up to 31st January 2014. Within this period, RATSA has been tasked to observe the use of its machinery and that it will only resort back to the machine inspection on 1st February 2014. Mwapek Mwenda, Movie TV News, Lusaka.